Hi everyone, it's Dean. Welcome to our daily devotional. Today is December the 23rd. When my grandfather was alive, I so enjoyed spending time with him. One of my favorite things to do with Pap, my grandfather, was to go downstairs in his, his home and play pool. I have no idea how many hours of pool he and I played through the years, but I know we played a minimum of three to four games each time we did play. On more occasions than I care to admit, just when I knew I had him beaten, He'd peer over his glasses, his nose would spread across his face, he'd smile, and then Pap would make a shot that I had never even dreamed was possible, much less makeable. I'd then ask him, where did you learn to play pool like that? I remember that after he told me about growing up playing pool, he'd get real serious with me and tell me about the electrical trade he had learned and then talk with me about what it took to operate some of the electrical companies he'd eventually owned. You know, my dad is the same way. He honed his skills in the construction and real estate development trade. People in those industries knew of my dad's his people personality and of his commitment to getting projects completed on time and under budget. His tools of the trade served him and our family well. Now, how about you? Maybe you haven't yet discovered God's calling for your life, but did you know that you still have tools for your own trade? What, what trade is that? It's the trade of living a life governed by the fruit of the Spirit. Might be a really good idea if today you open your Bible to the book of Galatians and once there read about and receive the tools of the trade provided to you by the Holy Spirit. Today's word, Galatians 5, verses 22 through 23. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. Against such there is no law. I'll see you tomorrow. God bless you.